Today may be Fat Tuesday, but we're talking about St. Patty's Day, which is next week. Yes. Chef Ken Hall is here from St. Brendan's, where good it's, morning. All, it's Irish festivities all the time, right? Every it's St. Patty's day. day every day. Every day. And uh, we're doing some unique Irish recipes right now, but before we get started, happy St. Patrick's Day. Yay! I've only, I only had a pink bow, so that's <laughs> he's been asking for years for that mug, so now it is yours. Oh, well, thank you so very much. And in return, I get a beet and goat cheese salad. What's Irish about that? Goat cheese, beets, um, and just the, the mix of greens. Um, it's, it's simple food. Okay. Irish food is, is very country food. It's very mm -hmm. simple food. So what we do is we take the log of goat cheese, cut it into medallions, okay. and I've got... Um, in the bowl, I've got hazelnuts and um, almonds. Two so we're of my just favorites. Excellent. Pop those in here. Okay. Just toss them around. I've got the oven on 350. What oh, we want to do is pop those in the oven. We want to warm them up so we can spread Ooh. them on our pita. So we'll toss these in oh, quick. That's as comfort, good, simple comfort food right there. Right, and then um, our dressing is eight tablespoons of olive oil. Okay. Teaspoon of Dijon. A little balsamic. Can I whisk that for you when you're ready? Yep. A little white wine vinegar and just a squeeze of lemon. Ooh, nice. Go ahead. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> in practice. Yep. Now, on the beet, what you do is you wrap it in foil and you roast it for an hour in a 350 degree oven. Oh, really? And that makes it nice and soft and it caramelizes the sugar so you have a sweeter dish. There you go. Ah. Uh, then we're going to put some beets so over good. here. It's not the beets you get in the deli line. The pickly ones. This is so good. And then we're just going to toss mm. that dressing with our greens. And we're going to put some greens right in the center. That's pretty. And then what I did was I roasted off uh, just a regular pita. How did you do that? Did you just uh, toast them in the oven? Yep. I okay. put a little bit of oil and salt and pepper and threw it in the oven. And then I like Look to put... Look at how pretty your plate is. Little orange on here for some color and some okay. sweetness. And then we'll take the Get goat cheese goat out. Cheese. Mm. And then we put our goat cheese on here. And then the little surprise that I do is I make a raspberry and orange mm. jam. We and have we to get a picture just, of that before I dive in. Oh, but can I try one of these guys? Absolutely. All right, now while I do that, that is just gorgeous. And you're going to be serving that? Yep, that's on our new menu. All right, and tell us a little bit about what you're doing this Saturday at St. This Saint Saturday Brendan's. is St. Baldrick's. Nice do. Um, we have, <laughs> Everybody's going to look like this. We have over 100 shavies. We're hoping to raise over $100,000 this year. Okay. And it goes to cure children's cancer. So who does it? And if you don't want your head shaved, how can you help out? Um, you can show up at noon and you can root on people and you can pledge money. You can go to stbaldricks.org and you can pledge money and it tells you who nationally is doing it. This is a national event. Tomorrow night we have Gaelic Storm at the Meyer Theater, big awesome. Irish band. Okay. Tickets still available and two of the top people are getting their head shaved Fantastic. by a little girl who has cancer. That would be a great, great night. So it's fantastic. we got a lot of exciting Raise things going on this week. All right. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Chef Ken will be back next hour for steak pies. Correct. That sounds delicious, too. We'll be right back. You're watching Good Day, Wisconsin.